The Tchaikovskys were a typical mid-19th-century Russian family. Ilya Tchaikovsky, the composer's father, was an emotive and sensitive man. No other element would describe him better than affection and amiability. He had a post as mine engineer and settled down in a town in the border of Western Russia. Ilya Tchaikovsky had a first marriage, but his wife died soon after, and they had a child, Zinaida. Right after becoming a widower, Ilya has married Alexandra Andreevna Dacier, a tall, elegant woman whom, contrary to Ilya's amiable and loving personality, was psychologically more reserved and austere. In 1838, the couple gave birth to Nikolai, Tchaikovsky's elder brother, and two years later the future great composer was born. Piotr Ilyich Tchaikovsky was a very sensitive child. He was not necessarily a prodigy, but he soon demonstrated increasing imaginative skills, firstly on literature through some poetic work, and later he deeply developed his musical gifts, mainly at the piano. A few years later, a sister named Alexandra was born also, with whom Tchaikovsky maintained much proximity through all his life, and also a younger brother, named Hippolyte, soon became a new member of the Tchaikovsky family. Later, Tchaikovsky had also two younger brothers. They were twins, Anatoly and Modest. The latter became a dramatist and librettist, and Tchaikovsky's first biographer. Fanny Durbach, the tutor and teacher, became an important figure in Tchaikovsky's life, although she stayed only four years taking care of him and his brothers. Expressing how immense were her memories from her short period with the Tchaikovsky's in Votkinsk, she kept with her much of the composer's poems from childhood in French and Russian for nearly 50 years after leaving Votkinsk, as mentioned from Modest when he visited her after the composer's death. <laughs> 